Does this look like the face of a father who wants to fight? I miss them so much. I don't know. I don't know what to do. This is not what I wanted. <laughs> I miss you guys so much. <laughs> I like to... This house is empty. I just miss the the running back and forth. The, the driving around, the going to the park, the everything, everything. <clears throat> I didn't ask for this. I'm not perfect. I uh, I made a lot of mistakes. I never intended to hurt anyone at all I'm just scared you know I <clears throat> I'm afraid that I'm not going to see you guys like ever you know I remember the last time that I felt this kind of pain was when uh, when Nikki took Chayton Daly away. I just I couldn't stand it, and uh, your mommy was there for me. Any time that. Any time that I would cry over them, and now she's doing it to me. It's just so painful when all you wanted to do was take control of your life back take control of your belongings and and your property and she didn't try to take any of my property but we were supposed to split the clothes down the middle you know like negotiate just split the clothes down the middle like she gets some I get some I wasn't trying to tell her what she could have and what she couldn't have. I was not trying to do that at all. Uh, I wasn't trying to control anybody. I was trying to control me. I was trying to control my, my own stuff. My own storage unit. I asked her to leave. Because I just couldn't trust her. I just couldn't trust her. And she wouldn't leave. So I, uh... I removed her. I escorted her off 
or out of the unit. I didn't do it with any intent to harm her or, or hurt her in any way, you know? I just wanted her out. I didn't want to take any of her stuff. I didn't want to take all of the girls' stuff. I didn't handle it the way that it, it could have been handled. I handled it wrong myself. I felt like I was defending my property and uh, that's really all I can say about that but this is just too much, too far. I can't handle it. <sighs> I don't know why you were brought into it. I don't think I'll ever know why you were brought into it. You weren't even there. You had nothing to do with it. I can't say anything else. I'm already pushing it. At this point, I just miss you so much. Both of you girls, I just miss you so much. I just want to see you. You are gone for two months. You come back, you spent the first night back here with me. And then the next day, this stupid fucking bullshit. This stupid bullshit happens that you have nothing to do with. <sighs> yeah, I better stop.